All right, today I'm gonna make a very simple dish, a few ingredients. One onion, four potatoes, we're gonna peel and slice, a little bit of nutmeg, butter, chicken, whole chicken cut up that I marinated. All right, the marinade is a little, uh, there's a little vinegar in here, uh, red wine vinegar, um, uh, garlic, pepper, oregano, onion powder, very simple, all right? That's in there, that's been marinating for like two days and I have some salt, pepper, and butter, and that's it. It's a very simple uh, dish. It's gonna be a boulanger potato, basically, which is a, a classic French dish, right? Which is like sliced potato with onions, layered like a gratin without, like a potato gratin without, um, without cream or milk, all right? So we're going to do that. It's kind of like that, right? Oh, that's not the boulanger potato. All right, everybody relax. We're going to do some onions on the bottom, potatoes, and we're going to roast the chicken on top of the potatoes. So all that chicken juice, when it roasts, all that thing marries together and it becomes a delicious meal. A one, Basically a one-pot meal or a one-casserole meal. And uh, that's it, man. Let me get started. So first thing, I'm, before I start anything, I'm going to pull the chicken out. Get it drying a little. So you're gonna put the skin side down, skin dries a little bit. If we get some color on the skin, that'd be good. It's probably not gonna get crispy because it's been marinating so long. I'm not gonna dry it out. So we'll see the we're gonna put it skin side up. So I'll put the skin side down on the thing to get some of that, that marinade off. See, that's good for that thing. Look, you see how it changes the color? It's like when you add acid to anything, right? People say don't add acid, but you see it starts, it starts cooking the meat almost. That's a lot of flavor in there, so we don't care. I might pour that into the casserole. Eh, why not? All right, let me clean my hands. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna put this to the side. Let that come up. Oof. It smells fantastic already. So, I'm gonna start off with the onion. Okay, I'm just gonna cut this part of the onion off. You can save this for stock if you'd like, or not. You can save that for stock, like I said. Just cut the onion in half. Peel it, try not to peel too much, of just the necessary layer, right, see? You don't wanna waste onion. There's some chefs out there, they'll kill you, you wasting onion. Some of them are probably watching this, that's why I uh, make sure not to waste anything. They beat me good back in the days. Oh. Hello, see? Just, just take your time. Yeah. Oh. Come on, little flowers. Oh, there you go. It's cool. All right. I don't have the luxury of 50 million side tiles, but you know, try to wipe down as you're going. Okay, so now we'll see. See, but this one you see has a little brown, it's probably gonna be hard. That won't melt when you cook it, so, see, look. It's like paper, you don't want that, you don't want that in your food. Look at that, Jesus Christ, look at that. Oh, finally. You can save it for stock if you'd like, you know? If you wanna save the earth, when you let it time. I was gonna slice it across, see the onion? Slice across, we're gonna put it on the bottom. Remember though, we're gonna oil. Let's oil the bottom of the cast for a little. So later on we clean. Not too crazy, see? Let's oil. oil. Onions. You know, they don't gotta be super thin, but thin enough. You don't want like super chunks. You want this to lay down flat, you know? Okay. This is gonna this is gonna absorb some of that uh some of the chicken uh marinade and the chicken fat that roast off that. But still, let's add a little salt. All right, a little fresh pepper. Boom. That's one layer. Okay, I'll wipe down. 
tapes. Put this little onion over here. You know what I can do? See some of this butter that I had? There's gonna be a lot of chicken fat, but this never hurts. A little butter on the bottom. A little touch. Okay. All right, now for the potatoes. I'm gonna peel these potatoes. Before I know the sun was in the video, but what can I do? I'm at the mercy of uh, Mother Nature. See, that's already, that doesn't look good, so I'm gonna cut that off. See how bad it is? You can still use the potato seed. Oh. Conserve all the potato that we, that we can, right? That can go into the fish still. Right? Oops. Let's it up. Right, so we're preheating the oven to 400 degrees. All right. I'm gonna peel this potato. Boom. Peel that potato. All right, so I sliced the potatoes. I put them on top of the onions. I put a little butter, salt, pepper. See, onions, salt, pepper, butter, and nutmeg. Okay, now I'm gonna add the chicken to that to the top. Very simple. Look, boom, 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 boom. Like that on top. I'm gonna wash my hands. That's it. I'm gonna put it in the oven for uh, let's see, we'll do we'll do 45 minutes, we'll do 30 minutes at 400 and then we'll check them. So I will add another touch of olive oil to the top. Yeah, a little touch, a little touch, a little touch. Why not? See that? A little more salt. Voice helps a little salt. Da -da 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 -da. Come up high. That's it. We're gonna go in. So 400 uncovered. See that? Boom. Oh, shit. I forgot to take all my stuff out of the oven. So there it is, 400 degrees. Those are my pans. Look at that, now they're scorching hot. But hey, everybody's okay. See, I'm gonna check halfway through. Oh, huh? there it goes. See, look at that. See that? Look at that action. What I'm talking about. Put it a little deeper. All right, that's good. That's what we want to Look see. how beautiful that looks. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the temple of the chicken. Oof. Let's make sure. See where we're at. Look at that. Yeah, there's the thermometer. All right, they're cooked. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to pull the chicken off of it and let the potatoes keep cooking. You know? I'm going to pull the chicken off of this, let the potatoes get a little more color and keep cooking, and then uh, we'll be ready for dinner. Actually... See, I wasn't expecting the, the skin to get that crispy. But look at that. Woo! You hear that? That's a good sign, boys. Good job. All right. These are the potatoes. See, roasting all that in the butter and the chicken fat that was left behind. I pulled the chicken out. But there, I'm about to pull it out in about two minutes. Let's get a bit more color. Look at those onions. It's going to be so delicious. Let's check them out. See that? Nice color. They like fried and all that. Or even like cold feed, fried, whatever you want to call it. It's delicious. Look at that. Hypnotizing hug. So you have it. I'm going to plate this bad boy up. I got some broccoli with it too, you know? So here we go. I'm plating uh, put a little of the potato on the plate. Don't mind the screaming child. All right? The leg. And a thigh. All right, boom. What do I got? Some broccoli. Don't worry, he's fine. He's just, uh, you know. And then for my sauce, I use the finest. Just like in France. Rest in peace, chicken.